Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another podcast video. I uh, hope you guys are having a wonderful day as I'm doing. So, uh, yeah, well, I guess yeah, in today's podcast, in today's podcast video, yeah, we're going to finish the, you know, rest of the Magic Trial second book. Because, yeah, I remember last week we finished in the middle of the story. So it's time to finish the rest of the story. Well, so yeah, as always, I'm gonna remind you guys. Uh, I'm gonna remind you guys the story I told you in part one, as always, because uh, you know, I mean, yeah. Well, yeah, some of you guys are asking me like, "Hey, David, like, why are you, uh, why are you telling the uh, story that you told us in part one?" I mean, we are we already know, and so yeah, I'm gonna answer to this question. So um, like because uh, you know, I mean. Some of you guys might forget the story, and also maybe there might there is a people who is watching this video for the first time. So yeah, I'm just gonna remind you guys really quickly. So yeah, let's do it. So yeah, so and then the part one, the the so the first story. How do I see? The first chapter to five chapter, the story was like, uh, so Jack and Annie, Jack and Annie go to Magic Treehouse again. I mean, after their journey from Dinosaur, you know, they take rest and next day they go to Magic Treehouse again and they found the book about night and, and yeah, they travel to the time of night by Magic Treehouse and, and yeah, and yeah, and in the books, the book says there is a feast the feast is being held in the castle and they were like, you know, really interested in it, right? So they went so they went to the castle and they were like, you know, looking around the castle a little bit and they also, you know, want to go to the feast place. So like you know, they follow the, you know, music sound, they follow the, you know, delicious food sound, you know, delicious food smell, not sound. And they follow these two, you know, because they they want to go to the feast place. And yeah, like yeah, in the yeah, in the big room, the feast was going on. Like a lot of people were, you know, having a conversation. Some people were playing musical instruments, and also yeah, some people were eating foods. And yeah, Dragon and you were like, you know, watching at the back, you know, without their without people's, you know, knowing because you know they don't want to get they don't want them to know because you know, uh. No one knows Jack and Annie, who is in Castle, because you know, Jack and Annie is not the person who is in the time of night, and and yeah, so yeah, they're from out of town. So yeah, no one knows Jack, so they might think like you know they're enemies, so they might you know kill Jack and Annie. They might arrest them, so yeah, they don't want everybody to see them. So they that's why they look Jack and Annie look people you know enjoying fists at the back, but suddenly. Uh, Guards, you know, suddenly someone found, the guards found Jack and Annie, like, hey, who are you, you know, like chasing them. So, you know, Annie and Jack were so surprised. So they were like, oh, the guards find so, you know, let's run, you know. So, you know, they run away up along the, you know, hallway. And they stopped, they stopped running when they found the, how do I say, the, they stopped running when they found the door and, and Jack was like, you know, let's go inside the door and hide inside there, you know. So yeah, they check up the door and they go inside. And actually, in the, you know, inside the door, there were inside the room, there were tons of uh how do I say suits and you know helmets, so weapons, you know. So yeah, they were at they were at an armory. So yeah, they were at an armory. And yeah, well actually, yeah, Jack was pretty interested. And it's like, you know, wow, I mean, these suits are pretty cool. Well, I want to try, I want to try them on. Like, so firstly, yeah, Jack put the helmet on. But you know what happens is, uh, yeah, the helmet was so heavy. And like, and Jack felt like, you know, he's having 10-year-old kids on his head, you know, which is super heavy. So, you know, he's like, you know, he can't balance. And he, I mean, and also he's very heavy. So he fell down. And you know he was you know trap and also and he was yeah he was trying to you know get off the helmet but you know it, it was it was not easy so yeah he was struggling 
try to, you know, he'll struggle trying to, you know, get the helmet off, but suddenly yeah, someone lifts the track and yeah, he take off the helmets and in front of Jack, like there were there were guards yeah, in front of Jack and Annie, there were uh, guards and yeah, which means yeah, Jack and Annie get caught by the guards. So I guess I'm pretty sure we finished the story here uh, last week. So yes, we're going to continue the story from here. So let's do it. Oh, and, and before we do it, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe the video. Like and subscribe to this channel. It really helps me a lot. So yeah, well, if you guys did that, well, thank you so much. And yeah, let's keep continue. Yeah, let's continue. So, uh, and so in front of Jack and Annie, there were three guards, and but but they were, and actually they were quite different. I mean, they they all have their own you know char characteristics like. So the first guy was, wait a minute, yeah, just one moment. Yeah, the first guy who was, so the first guy was holding a torch because, you know, it's pretty dark. Some places are dark. So yeah, the first guy who was holding a torch, had, you know, squinty eyes, you know, like, you know, I mean, it's really hard to do. Yeah, the first guy has squinty eyes and the, it's so yeah, the second, the second guy who was holding, you know, and the second guy who was holding Jack had, you know, red face. Yeah. And the third guy who was holding Annie had, you know, a lot of mustache, like, you know, a lot of, you know, mustache that men usually have. So, and, and, yeah, and these guards caught Jack and Annie. But, you know, what, like, Annie was, like, you know, kicking and shouting. I mean, Jack was calm, but, you know, Annie wasn't. Annie was like hey leave me alone like we didn't do anything bad like you guys are bad you know you know and he was shouting and kicking to the guards like yeah but and the and the guards was holding and he was like you know stop you know, stop because yeah yeah she stopped Annie and and the red face you know who's holding the red face who's holding Jack you know asked them like yeah who are you guys are you guys uh are you guys idiots are you guys you know enemies you know Egyptians foreigners Romans, yeah, but you know what? And he was like, and he was like, no, you dummies. I mean, you know, it's not a how do I say? It's not a kind comment. It's like you know when you hear this kind of you know how do I say comment, you know, you feel bad. I mean, I, yeah, you feel upset, right? So and yeah, and he said like this, and you know, Jack was like, oh man, like why is she doing like that? I mean, Jack could understand her because you know maybe they might get angry and you know kill them. Or yeah, or arrest arrest them. And so yeah, Jack was kind of worried. But well, yeah, yeah, any but I don't know why yeah, usually yeah, any is this any is usually this type. Honestly, I it's hard to understand it's hard to explain. Well anyway. And the guards was like, you know, yeah, arrest them, you know. And the other guards said, Yeah, yeah, let's take yeah, let's take this keys, uh let's take this keys to the underground prison. And and so yeah, the guards yeah guards uh, take them out of the um, take them out of the armory and but yeah but actually you know John was like John was like you know how to say John was like looking around like because you know he was like looking around like you know where's my backpack I think you know Jack dropped his backpack somewhere while he's wearing helmet so you know John was like you know looking at his backpack but one guard says John you know like go. You no, know, where, where are you doing? Yeah, like, just go, you know, with a big push. You know, Jack has no choice, but, you know, he had to leave his backpack. So, um, so yeah, these five people are going to the underground Pearson, like, uh, so, yeah, they're, yeah, so, yeah, they're, you know, they're walking the really dark and, you know, creepy hallway. They're, you know, walking down the winding stairs and, but yeah, and yeah, they're walking down the winding stairs while they're while they're going to the underground. Jack is still here, you know, and he's and he's shouting, you know, and he's kicking, you know, and it's moving body really hard. Because yeah, it was like, hey, you know, like we didn't do anything bad, you know. You guys are bad, you know, you guys you guys are not kind, you know. And but actually, you know, like the guards didn't take it as, as seriously at all. Like, you know, they're just, you know, laughing, like 
they're just giggling, you know. They didn't listen to any. So, you know, it was no use. Uh, and yeah, now they're, they're still going to the underground person. And now they're in the, they're in front of the you know, underground person. So, they, yeah, they, the guards open the door and yeah, they enter the uh, prison. And, you know, it was like, it's underground, right? So the prison was really dark and, yeah, it seems yeah, really dark. And also, you know, it was some also, how do I say, the chain? The chain was hanging on the wall. There were some chains hanging on the wall. And there were also some water, you know, dropping from the cell, like, you know, water dripped, dripped a little bit. Uh, and, you know, and, I mean, it was also pretty cold. I mean, you know, it, it was a really, you know, creepy place. I mean, well, you know, I would have, yeah, if I were there, you know, I would be so scary. I mean, dark and cold. So, yeah, which is, you know, so creepy. But anyway, and, yeah, there were like, you know, it we're going, and the guards was like, you know, hey, we're going to take this case here over the, you know, until the, you know, feast, until the feast ends. And then, you know, we're going to take them to the Duke. I mean, the other guys was like, yeah, Duke knows how to take care of Thief. And, and yeah, and the other guys says, uh, yeah, there will be hanging tomorrow. And, you know, unless the rest gets them first, you know, like they're kind of making fun of Jack and Annie, you know. And yeah, one day said, you know, like yeah, there, be, there will be hanging unless the rest gets them first. And, and after they said, after one guard said, you know, all the all the guards, you know, started to giggling, like you know, laughing. Yeah, it was they were like, you know, making fun of them. And but actually yeah, suddenly, yeah, Jack Jack saw that, you know, Annie had his backpack. Yeah, Annie was having Jack's backpack. And like Annie was, you know, unzipping the backpack, you know, quietly, you know, without guards knowing and and oh, oh wait, oops, one more. I bite my you know, I don't know. I don't know the word red thing, but it's fine. Oh, so uh, anyway, you know, like Annie was unzipping the. Oh, yeah, Annie was unzipping Jack's backpack, you know, quietly, and and a lot and girls were trying to, you know, chain them with, chain them with how do I say iron. Iron. Well, I don't. I don't. You know, chain guard. Guard was trying to chain them with iron things, you know. Kind of, well, I, it's really hard to say, but, you know, suddenly Annie was like, you know, Annie wiped off the flashlight from the, you know, backpack and was like, you know, shining the flashlight in front of guards, like, you know, ta-da, yeah, you know, and actually the guards froze. Uh, you know, they're all, all they're doing is just, you know, looking at Annie's, you know, how to say flashlight and you know, like when Annie switched the flashlight, you know, guards were so scared they jumped against the, you know, wall, and um, and you know the guards who was holding a torch was so surprised that you know he dropped the torch, and you know it, he dropped the torch, uh, and you know Annie was like, yeah, fill my magic wand. How is it, you know, or get down, or I'll you know, I'll wipe you guys off, you know. So, so yeah, but yeah, actually, Jack was like, you know, Jack couldn't believe what's happening. And Jack couldn't believe, you know, the scene happening in front of him. Like, you know, he was like, uh, you know, his jaw drops. Like, oh, uh, you know, how do I say? Yeah, like you know, he's um, you know, it's unbelievable, right? You know, how can they, you know, how the guards get scared of, uh, you know, lies? I mean, also, you know, and he's, it looks like and it's controlling the guards, right? So you know, Jack was like, Jack, Jack couldn't believe his eyes. And and he was like, you know, scaring the guards, the flashlight, like one by one, get down, or you know, or I'll destroy you, you know. And and yeah, they were they were all, you know, covering their eyes and you know, gasping in fear. Yeah, like they were all really scary. And and yeah, well, and he was like, and then and he was like, uh, hey Jack, let's go. Like they're they're all, you know, they're all scared. I mean, it's time, yeah, we need to go, we need to get out of the, you know, basement, yeah, we need to get out of the, you know, underground prison, and yeah, and then, yeah, they both run, run out of the underground prison, and, like, you know, they're still running, like, they're, you know, climbing up the, 
winding winding snares and you know they're running all the way the all the way to the you know how do I say a uh, hallway and but suddenly and yeah, suddenly they hear the shouting from the distance like you know hey stop this kind of shouting yeah, which means yeah they're being chased again like guards woke up again the guards is not scared at all right now yeah well anyway they, they are cha they're being chased again and And also, yeah, they hear the dogs barking. I mean, this time, I guess they all, they also have the dogs, like you know, police dog, who is really who is trained to catch the you know thieves. Well, yeah, so they can also hear the dog bark, and they were like, you know, oh, I guess yeah, I guess you know the guards are trying to catch us again. And but you know, Jack was like, yeah, while they're running at the you know hallway, there was a you know door, and Jack was like, hey, hey, Danny, let's go inside the door. Let's hide inside the door and. You know, Jack was like, you know, opened the door really fast. Jack opened the door quickly and, you know, pushed Annie into the door. And he also, you know, hide inside the door and he closed the door shut. And, and Jack, and yeah, when Jack closed, like, you know, Annie is, how do I say, when Jack closed the door, Annie, you know, switched on the flashlight, you know, like, to see where they are. Like, I mean, how's the room looks like? How's the room there in looks like? So, and in the room, they were like, I see, you know, some wooden barrel and some, you know, bags that they can put something. And, and Jack was like, you know, well, I, we don't know anything about this place. Let me, let me read a book about it. Like, so yeah, Jack was like, you know, hey, hey Annie, give me the books and give me the book and uh, how to say flashlight. And yeah, how to say, yeah, Annie gave the you know, flashlight to uh, Jack. And, you know, Jack was like, how do I say, Jack turned the page really quickly. Because, you know, now they're being chased and they need to escape this castle as fast as they can, you know, before they get caught. So, you know, Jack was like, yeah, looking at the books. But, yeah, but Jack was finding the picture about the, you know, room. But actually, suddenly, they hear the, you know, how do I say, the sound of the guards. Like, they hear the footstep, like, you know, guards running sound. And so, and it was like, Jack, yeah, but Jack, stop it. I guess, yeah, the guards is, guards is coming here. And you know, Jack was like, Jack turned on the switch quickly and and Jack Jack closed the book. And yeah, and Jack and Annie hide behind the door. And but suddenly the door opened, and you know, the guards was like, you know, looking around, looking in the how do I say in the room, like with the torch. But yeah, luckily guards didn't find Jack and Annie. Like uh, yes, how about yeah, in a in about like minute the door closed and your guards go away. And Jack and Annie were like, uh, you know, and here is says, uh, oh, yeah, like, yeah, Jenny was like, you know, oh, what a relief. I guess, yeah, we should hurry or, or else, yeah, before we get caught, I mean, they might come back, you know. So, yeah, I mean, Jack was like, Jack turned the page again, you know, Jack found, Jack, Jack trying to, you know, found the page about the room quickly. I and mean, this time his hands were kind of shaking because, you know, so nervous, right? I mean, they're being uh, chased. I mean, someone is trying to, Guards is trying. Guards are trying to find Jack and Annie. I mean, so yeah, if I were Jack and Annie, I would have been also really scared. I would have also, you know, be so you know nervous. Like, uh, well, anyway, yeah, they're, they're finding the picture quickly, and Jack, yeah, Jack found the picture, and it, Jack was like, "Hey, Annie, here, look at the, look at the, look at here." I mean, I guess this is the map of the castle. And so and, and I was like, "Oh yeah, look, Annie, yeah." So here, I guess, I guess you. Yeah, is storeroom, I guess, yeah. So we're in storeroom, and and over here, here is a trap door, you know, like, you know, Jack read aloud to Annie. So Jack, Jack was like, you know, this door leads from the, so yeah, the book says, this door leads from the storeroom through a secret passage to a precipice over the mold. But, well, actually, they didn't know what precipice means. Like, Annie were like, hey, Jack, what is precipice? And Jack, well, Jack was like, you know, I don't know, but we'll find it out soon. But first, we need to find the trap door. And you know, Jack was trying, and they were like, you know, looking around the room. Well, they found the yeah trap door anyway, and actually, they opened the trap door, and yeah, inside the trap door, there were you know like you know small, there were like small letter, and Jack and I were hey, there's a letter, like yeah, let's climb down, and so. 
a dragon any how to say dragon any climb down the ladder and when they reach the bottom of the how do I say uh ladder when they reach the bottom of the ladder and you know Jack shine the flashlight and you know, project, turn on the flashlight and look around and and yeah as how how do I say yeah and actually there was the you know there was the underground tunnel. There was kind of like a small tunnel. And so, yeah, I guess yeah, Dragon and you were like, hey, let's go through the tunnel. I guess this is the, this is the, you know, way to escape. And so yeah, they were like, but the actual tunnel was pretty small. So Drag crouched, Dragon and crouched down and, you know, walked really, you know, walked uncomfortably, like, you know, walking, walking while they crouched so you know which is really uncomfortable and but so yeah but Jack was like you know and the tunnel is really dark right i mean it's so dark they can't see anything without flashlights so you drag her on the so while they're while Jack is walking through the tunnel drag her on the flashlight and look around but suddenly the flashlight is getting weaker like you know jack turn off and turn on again to see yeah turn off and turn on again but Jack, i guess yeah Jack was like Oh wait, hey Annie, the light is getting weaker. I guess the battery is almost, you know, how do I say? It? Yeah, I guess the battery is the uh, how, oh wait, wait a minute, I'm terrible at it. Uh yeah, Jack was like, Oh, the light is getting weaker. I guess the I guess it's almost running out of battery. And it was like, Oh no, really? I guess then you know we should hurry, right? You know. So you know, they move faster. They move faster and the how do I say flashlight becoming more blurry, so they so they need to you know escape the castle as fast as they can, and yeah, so suddenly, a uh, Jack Jack and Annie are in another Jack and Annie are in another you know wooden door, yeah, which means yeah the tunnel is finally end, and yeah Jack you know Jack opened the door and you know looked around. I mean Jack opened the door and poked his head out of the you know wooden door like to see was there but but actually it was uh but actually it was it was foggy and dark so i mean jack couldn't see anything i mean even even this you know light it's not even it's not dark but it's hard to see when there's a fog but you know it's fog but it's also dark as well so it's it's almost impossible to see i mean so you know like turn on a god or something well anyway yeah they couldn't see anything so uh so like Jack were, you know, trying to reach the ground with his hands, you know, like, but, you know, actually he can't touch anything, you know, he can't touch the ground, right? So he was like, and, and, but I, and I know it was like, you know, hey, Jack, what can you see in the door? What can you see out of the door? And Jack was like, hey, I can't see anything. But, well, Jack was like, well, but I guess, you know, we're finally out of the castle, but, you know, and, but Jack was like, you know, Jack couldn't touch the ground, right? So Jack was like, I'm going to uh my I'm going to yeah catch with my feet first. I'm going to touch the floor with my feet. And Jack was like, you know, how do I see? Uh Jack Jack was trying to, you know, reach the feet, but you know it was precipice, so like, you know, they fought Jack fall. Uh yeah, you know, Jack fall actually uh, yeah, before Jack well, you know, Jack was, you know, hanging on the hanging on the how do I say the floor Jack was hanging on the floor and Jack was like oh hell, hey Annie I guess yeah hey, Annie will help help me I mean yeah grab my hand but Annie was like hey Jack I can see like where are you and suddenly you know Jack's Jack started you know losing his power of finger like you know he's sleeping slowly and now he fell I mean he fell onto the moat I mean so now he's in water so you know, I mean, a lot of, you know, water goes into, you know, Jack's nose and, you know, Jack drink a lot of water. And Jack was like, yeah, Jack was, you know, having a hard time floating on the, floating on the moat. And yeah, and also his glasses almost fell, but yeah, luckily he grabbed it at the time. And, and you know, like Jack, Jack was, you know, trying to, you know, swim on the, you know, moat. Uh, but, and how do I say? And Jack was like, hey, Annie, Annie, I'm here. Well, you know, help me, right? And wait a minute. 
I mean, but so Jack was trying to get out of the, you know, moat and wear his glasses again, but, you know, the backpack and, you know, the wet clothes and wet shoes were too heavy. So he was even, you know, having a hard time floating. And so, you know, he was keep swimming, but uh, suddenly uh, he hear another splash, like, you know, splash, you know, like the water sound, water splashing sound. And actually, and the, so yeah, the shouting came from the distance, like, Hey Jack, I'm here. I'm here too. Yeah, it was Annie. Um, so yeah, like Annie. So right now they both are in the moat, and it, the books. Wait a minute. And and Jack were like, you know, so worried, right? I mean, Jack, Jack were like, you know, what if there is a, um, what if there is an alligator in the water? Oh, I'm so scared. Like, what if there is a, a how to say? human eating fish you know what if there's you know what if there's a dangerous fish or if there's a shark you know they were jack was really worried but suddenly you know what something touched jack and jack were like you know so surprised like ah oh, you know what is it but actually yeah luckily it was annie and um, yeah so luckily it was annie and annie was like hey jack it's me relax you know and here what well, one moment and you know annie and annie and jack you know Obviously, grab your hand to each other and any swim. I mean, any has a life on. So, how do I say this? Well, yeah, with Annie's help, uh, they so they reach the ground, they reach, yeah, they reach the ground, and now, yeah, they're on the wet grass. And this says, wait a minute, you know, yeah, Jack put his glasses on again, but actually, you know. The, if there were too many falls, I mean, the, it was so foggy, so Jack couldn't see anything. He can't, yeah, he can't see nothing, I mean. And also, yeah, I mean, it was so cold, right? Because, you know, they were at the, they were at the water, and now, and also the weather, I guess, yeah, it's not summer there, I guess, you know, it's kind of like, you know, winter or autumn there. So actually, yeah, Jack was so, Jack and Annie were so cold, like their teeth was chattering, like, you know. You know your teeth chatter when you're so cold. I guess you know. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So, uh, so yeah, they're at the dark, but it suddenly they hear the how do I say? They hear the horse sound, like you know, <laughs> you know, me. The horse sound. Well, I mean, I'm pretty. I'm not good at you know pretending animal. I'm not good at. Uh, I'm not good at you know making sound of animal. Well, anyway, but yeah. Suddenly, they hear the horse sound uh, in the distance, and and at the time, the how do I say the full moon came. They yeah, they could see the full moon, and yeah, with the help of full moon, they yeah, Jack and Annie could have seen the you know night. I mean, yeah, there was a night in front of Jack and Annie, like there were all, yeah, the night was few feet away from Jack and Annie, and yeah, the night was on the you know, and yeah, they could have seen the night. And so it's how do I say this? And I and it was like, you know, hey, it's him and hey Jack, let's go to him. And but you know what? And Jack was like, Hell any what are you talking about? And and it was like, you know, oh well I, oh the night the night is trying to help us, but you know, Jack is like, you know, how do you know? And it was like, uh, well, yeah, I'm I'm just feeling and well well, you know, it's, I'm I'm pretty sure yeah the night is going to help us. And it was like, and he walked to the night, and uh, the night helps uh, Jack and Annie to sit on the horse because you know the horse is pretty tall, so it's hard to you know jump on the horse for kids like you know Jack and Annie. But well, anyway, anyway, so the night helps Jack and Annie to you know jump on the horse. So now they're free, are on the horse, and and it was like, hey, hey, let take us to the you know tree. I was like. You know, go over here like this way. You know, and it was like guiding the, how do I say, uh, the night. And, and it was like, oh, here there is a treehouse. So, yeah, the night takes them. Night takes them to the treehouse. Night takes night stop in front of the rope ladder, and and you know, and Jack and Annie were like, you know, thank you so much. And and then the night disappears into the fox. And and they and they climb the ladder. Uh, it says yeah, they climb the ladder and let's see yeah, they climb the ladder 
and they found a book about Pennsylvania, and they found a book about Brow Creek, you know, in their hometown. They make a wish, and now they're back at their uh, home, and now they're back at their home, and how do I say, now they're back at their home, and they were like, so actually, they came to Magic Crowds really early, like, you know, they went, they go to Magic Crowds at, how do I say, at 6, you know, 5.30 a.m., they 5.30 a.m., so it, it was really early, but so, yeah, but you know, uh, well, anyway, Magic Crowds so high, so yeah, they can see their house in Magic Tree House, and yeah, they, they can see their house in the Magic Tree House, and they see their house, and actually, the light was on on the second floor of their house and you know they were like oh i guess you know mom and dad is going to wake up i guess yeah, we need to go fast so yeah they they go to their home right away but luckily i guess yeah the mom and dad didn't come mom and dad didn't check the you know first floor so you know they didn't get caught i mean so yeah well they didn't get caught and yeah dragon dragon and changed their clothes into their pajama you know and yeah, now they go to their each room. And you know, Jack was Jack was trying to, you know, pull out the how do I say pull out his notebook and his stuff like so he was trying to yeah find his notebook and pencil but so but so yeah, so he pushed so he put his hands on the backpack but he touched something and, and so he put you know he was like oh what is it you know he grabbed the he grabbed the he grabbed something actually that was the you know blue silk mark blue blue silk bookmark and and actually and and and, and on the blue silk bookmark there were there was a letter m on it so and and actually jack was like you know jack, jack also has the you know gold medallion that they get they found it at you know dinosaur time and jack looked a uh, silk mark, Jack Luke bookmark, and also the medall medallion, and the letter M, the letter M was exactly the same. So I mean, Jack was like, you know, it is a really amazing fact, right? So another, you know, secret soul. So and now Jack is thinking like, well, is there a really, is there, a, is there really a magic person, you know? And yeah, Jack is now, yeah, I mean, it's getting curious. I'm getting curious. Well, anyway, and now. Jack put the gold medallion and blue book silk blue silk bookmark on the desk, and Jack is and Jack grabbed the pencil and notebook. Now he's writing the new facts like the same person, and he was trying to write more. Like you know, he was trying to write the letter M on the notebook before he write the letter M. You know, he fell asleep. He fell asleep. So, well, I guess yeah, the story ends over here. So, well, I guess yeah, this is going to be the end of the end of the podcast so well uh, yeah i hope you guys enjoyed or i hope you guys find it useful and yeah have a great day we'll see you next week uh, bye